Okay, and basically that's it. Let's recap. We created our onboarding page uh, model. The view uh, consists of uh, the pages, the top bar, uh, then the page views, progress pillars, which are inside the bottom bar, which also contains, oh, the button. I forgot to talk about the action on the button. Oh, good thing that I uh, made a recap. So uh, we're going to have a width animation uh, dot spring and the actual uh, content of the animation. Now, if index is less than the pages dot count minus one, then the index is going to be counted up. Otherwise, we are going to say did finish onboarding equals true. Okay, and then you can just take it from there inside your application. Okay, so I think everything is done now. Uh, inside the body, we just uh, extract, uh, compounded all of this. So uh, let's just select our, one of our uh, simulators and let's uh, build and run and see basically kind of the same thing that you already saw. Uh, let's just see, there we go. Uh, build faster, uh, let's just, okay. For some reason, we don't have uh, the actual uh, skip button over here. We're going to get back to that and we're going to debug it. There we go. And then back. Uh, let's just tap on back. It looks really nice. What about the skip? That works really nice. And then get started. Oh, and also not get started, continue. 